Hello guys, welcome to the next video of this playlist Python for Beginners. In this playlist, currently we are exploring Ops concept. So without wasting any time, let's continue the exploration of the same concept. For that, let's move to our destination folder. So this is our destination folder. I will simply open this folder in VS Code. So the folder is opening in VS Code and now let's open today's file which is day 49. So it's day 49 and not day 48. The title is super keyword. So this super keyword is initialized or a solution to the trap that we saw in last video. So if you have not saw the last video, please see that video first. So moving to this video, what is super keyword? So using super keyword, we can call or invoke parent class methods, which means that if you want to invoke a special method or initialize a constructor, when we initialize a child class constructor, we can use this super keyword or super method. And one speciality of this method is it can be only declared inside a class we cannot declare it outside the class which means that i cannot declare this super here it will simply give me an error as you can see the error is in front of you super is not defined so let's understand this concept by a simple coding concept so the code is very simple so i initialize the class phone this is constructor and the common function of by which is also available here so what will happen is that when i created the object of this child class and pass some values which is 15,000 apple and brand name or version name and after that I will simply print apple.by so what do you think after using this super.by keyword in this so what do you think the current code will print the output or it will give me error that it has no attribute name I hope you have given the answer in comment section now let's run the code and after that I will explain you this concept and as you can see the answer is in front of you in phone constructor by method in smartphone class and by method in phone class so i will simply explain you the code now so object was created it simply go to the smartphone class and it saw that there is no constructor predefined here so it simply go to its parent class which was underscore in it and there it initialized itself and that's why it printed first that in phone constructor here so first statement was printed when it simply visited the constructor of parent class then after that what happened as soon as i called this apple.by method it simply go to this class and def by self so it printed the contents in this method which is by method in smartphone class which is this after that this keyword was initialized which is super so this is a declaration of super super opening and closing bracket dot and the method name which we want to call so i want to call by method so it simply go to the by method which is this method as you can see and it printed by method in phone class the output is same as you can see i hope the importance of super dot by or super keyword is understandable to you this super keyword was designed as a solution to the trap that we saw in last video so this is a simple code now let's explore code 2 which is a uh, very very similar to this so what does the code say so uh, let's understand the code first so the code is very very easy so first is class phone simple it constructed initialization which is correct after that this is child class and i have added constructor here and it has three parameters price brand and version so when i created the object of this child class i passed these three parameters as you can see then what happened is that it will simply go to this constructor of child class which is this class and it will simply initialize self dot price after that it will print this statement which is correct uh, and then it will call it super dot constructor of parent class which is this constructor and it will pass the parameters as price brand and version so it will go to its parent class constructor which is this it will print this statement and initialize these three values which are price brand and version therefore this code will generate no error i will show you right now also this code will generate no output as i have not printed anything here only the print statement is printed which is in smartphone constructor which is this line and in phone constructor which is this line so first child class constructor was called then using this super keyword parent class constructor was called i hope this concept of super keyword is understandable to you 
So that's all for today's video. If you like this video, then don't forget to share it with your family and friends. Also, if you face any queries or have any doubts related to this video or any video in this playlist, you can simply message me on Instagram or comment section below. Also, the source code of today's video is available in video description. You can definitely check out it. Here comes the end of this video. Thanks for watching this video.